Hello everyone, welcome to online mining exam. Today's quiz is based on Mines Act for Mine Management, Legislation and General Safety subject. It is a part of our Achievers Practice Series initiative. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated about all future classes and quizzes. So in this quiz, there will be 10 questions and for every question you will get 30 second time to respond. After the time is up, the correct answer will be displayed on the screen. In case of any doubt pertaining to any question, please put them in comments after completing the quiz. For free study material, you can join our WhatsApp group. The link for the WhatsApp group is provided in the description of the video. इस क्विज में 10 क्वेश्चंस होंगे और प्रत्येक क्वेश्चन के लिए आपके पास 30 सेकंड का समय होगा समय खत्म होने पर सही ऑप्शन स्क्रीन पर डिस्प्ले कर दिया जाएगा किसी भी क्वेश्चन के बारे में कोई डाउट होने पर आप उन्हें क्विज खत्म होने के बाद कमेंट में डाल सकते हैं और फ्री स्टडी मटेरियल के लिए आप व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप ज्वाइन कर सकते हैं जिसका लिंक वीडियो के डिस्क्रिप्शन में दिया गया है सो द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज द प्रोविजन ऑफ माइंस एक्ट नाइनटीन फिफ्टी टू एक्सेप्ट दो सेक्शन सेवन एट नाइन फोर्टी फोर्टी फाइव एंड फोर्टी सिक्स shall not apply to any mine in which excavation is made for prospective only provided that not more than dash persons are employed on any day the options are a 10 b 15 c 20 d 17 e 12 your time starts now Time up. The correct answer is C. Twenty. Next question. The provisions of Mines Act, nineteen fifty-two, except those contained in section seven, eight, nine, forty, forty-five, and forty-six, shall not apply to any mine in which excavation is made for prospective only, provided that a not more than twenty persons are employed on any day. B. Depth of excavation is in non-coal does not exceed six meter. Depth of excavation in coal does not exceed 15 meter. No such excavation extends below super adjacent ground. E. All of the above. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is E. All of the above. Next question. The provisions of Mine Act, 1952, except those contained in Section 7, 8, 9, 40, 45, 40, and 46, shall not apply to any mine engaged in the extraction of concrete, marble, laterite, shingle, ordinary sand, ordinary clay, building stone, slate, road metal, earth, fuller earth, marl, chalk, and limestone, provided that A. The workings do not extend below super adjacent ground. B low explosives are used in connection with excavation C the working is done by open cast method D not more than 20 persons are employed on any day E all of the above your time starts now Time up. The correct answer is A. The workings do not extend below super adjacent ground. See a quick reminder to all of you that you just have 50 days remaining before the exam. सिर्फ 50 दिन बचे हैं आपके एग्जाम के लिए. Time का utilization अच्छे से करिए और practice regular basis पे करते रहिए. If anybody has any doubt or inquiry related to paid courses, they can call on the number displayed on the screen. The paid courses include a structured curriculum. 50 plus hours of live classes 30 mock tests for practice revision notes and premium whatsapp group access also you get recordings of the classes for revision paid courses mein aapko ek structured curriculum ke according classes hoti hain 
फिफ्टी प्लस आवर्स ऑफ लाइव क्लासेस आपको कराया जाएगा थर्टी मॉक टेस्ट होंगे एंड एक रिवीजन नोट्स भी हर टॉपिक पे आपको मिलेगा एक प्रीमियम व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप का एक्सेस मिलेगा जिसमें आप अपने डाउट्स पूछ सकते हैं और इसके साथ साथ क्लास की रिकॉर्डिंग भी आपको मिलेगी ताकि आप कभी भी जब भी चाहें उसे रिवाइज कर सकते हैं थैंक यू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द प्रोविजन ऑफ माइंस एक्ट 1952 एक्सेप्ट दोज कंटेंट इन सेक्शन सेवन एट नाइन फोर्टी फोर्टी फाइव एंड फोर्टी सिक्स सेल नॉट अप्लाई टू एनी माइन इंगेज इन द एक्सट्रैक्शन ऑफ कंकर मुर्रम लेटराइट सिंगल ऑर्डिनरी सैंड ऑर्डिनरी क्ले बिल्डिंग स्टोन स्लेट रोड मेटल अर्थ फ्लर्स अर्थ माल चौक एंड लाइम स्टोन प्रोवाइड दैट इन केस ऑफ ओपन कास्ट वर्किंग ए डेप्थ ऑफ एक्सकेशन डज नॉट एक्सीड सिक्स मीटर नॉट मोर देन फिफ्टी परसेंट आर एम्प्लॉयड ऑन एनी डे नो एक्सप्लोसिव आर यूज इन कनेक्शन विद एक्सकेशन डी ऑल ऑफ देव ई नन ऑफ देव योर टाइम स्टार्ट नाउ Time up. The correct answer is D. All of the above. Next question. The provisions of Mines Act 1952, except those contained in Section 7, 8, 9, 40, 45, 40, and 46, shall not apply to any mine engaged in the extraction of kankar, marram, laterite, shingle, ordinary sand, ordinary clay, building stone, slate, road metal, earth, fuller's earth, marl, chalk, and limestone, provided that the workings do not extend below super super adjacent ground. Here ordinary does not include. Here ordinary sand does not include. A. Molding sand. B. Glass sand. C. Mineral sand. D. All of the above. E. None of the above. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is D. All the given sides. Next question. Section three of Mines Act provides exception to some type of mines or mine workings where certain sections or provisions under the Mines Act may not be applied. Which of the following sections are not necessarily applied to every such mine excavation? A. Seven, eight, nine, forty, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six. B. Three, four, five, seven, eight, nine. C seven eight nine ten forty five forty six D seven eight nine forty forty five forty six E none of these. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is D. Seven, eight, nine, forty, forty-five, forty-six. Next question. As per the Mines Act, references to time of day are references to IST. What is IST? Indian Specific Time. B. Indian Service Time. C. Indian Space Time. D. International Standard Time. E. None of these. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is E. Section four of Mines Act mentions this. IST is Indian Standard Time. Next question. As for the Mines Act, references to the time of day are references to Indian Standard Time, which is a five and a half hours behind the Greenwich Mean Time, b five and a half days ahead Greenwich Mean Time, 
C. Five and a half minutes ahead of Greenwich Mean Time. D. Half of five hours ahead Greenwich Mean Time. E. None of these. Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is E. Indian standard time is five and a half hours ahead of Greenwich Mean Time. Okay. You have to focus on hours. The option B says days. You have to avoid those options. Okay. Next question. A government official is on a visit to Singri Mari Mines in India with a team of technical researchers from England. One of the researchers makes a call to his family at his hometown in England and gets to know that his family is having lunch. If the people in England generally takes lunch at 1 p.m. Greenwich Mean Time, at what time in India does the researcher call? A. 6.30 a.m. IST B. 7.30 a.m. IST C. 5.30 p.m. IST D. 6.30 p.m. IST E. 7.30 p.m. IST Okay, your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is D. 6.30 p.m. Next question. Chapter 2, Section 5 to 11 of the Mines Act deals with A. Penalty and Procedures B. Committees C. Inspectors and Certifying Surgeons D. Provisions as to Health and Safety E. Mining Operations and Management of Mines Your time starts now. Time up. The correct answer is C. Inspectors and Certifying Surgeon. Thank you everyone for your participation. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated about all future classes and quizzes. Share the video with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get benefited from our free initiatives. Thank you.